StarNet 8 includes direct support for the latest geoid models published by agencies like the United States National Geodetic Survey and Natural Resources Canada. If you are working on a grid-based project, like the Tutorial 4 Grid 3D Sample Project, the project's geoid modeling options can be set by going into your project options on the Modeling tab. Geoid models for your region can be downloaded by pressing the Info button and visiting the Microsurvey Help Desk. Some of the options on this page will link you to an appropriate national agency, while others will be a direct download. The geoid files must be saved into StarNet's mapping folder, which is also accessible here. Just turn on the option to perform geoid modeling and specify which geoid model to use. You can select from various formats a GHT file created by StarNet's free Star Geoid Companion utility, or BYN and BIN files published by your local survey agency. For example, several Canadian geoids. And I'm going to select geoid 2012A for the United States. If the Show Model Geoid Heights in Listing File option is turned on, then when you run the adjustment, the listing file will indicate your geoid separation at each point, as well as the average geoid separation. And of course, all transformations between orthometric elevations, as shown in your coordinate file, and ellipsoidal heights, as shown in your latitude and longitude file, will be calculated using the specified geoid model.